As Roosevelt took office in 1933, America was in the throes of the Great Depression. Unemployment was at an all-time high, banks were failing, and despair was ubiquitous. In his inaugural address, Roosevelt famously declared, the only thing we have to fear is fear itself, setting the tone for his presidency. Roosevelt's response to the crisis was the New Deal, a series of programs, public work projects, financial reforms, and regulations. The New Deal aimed to provide relief for the unemployed, recovery of the economy, and reform of the financial system. Initiatives like the Civilian Conservation Corps, the Works Progress Administration, and the Social Security Act not only provided immediate aid but also laid the groundwork for a more robust economic foundation. The onset of World War II presented a new set of challenges. Following the attack on Pearl Harbor, Roosevelt guided the nation into war. His leadership was instrumental in mobilizing the United States industrial might, transforming the country into the arsenal of democracy. Through fireside chats, he communicated directly with the American people, bolstering morale and unity. Internationally, Roosevelt was a key figure in the Allied strategy, working closely with Winston Churchill, Joseph Stalin, and other leaders to forge a united front against the Axis powers. His vision helped lay the foundation for the United Nations, setting the stage for a new era of international cooperation. In April 1945, just months before the end of World War II, Roosevelt passed away, leaving behind a legacy of leadership that transcended crisis. Through the depths of the Great Depression and the turmoil of World War II, FDR's resolve and innovative policies not only rescued the United States from despair but also reshaped the nation's future. Like and subscribe if you liked the video.